Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel at NDN TV Nigeria. Click on the subscribe button and be the first to get notifications. In our continuing effort to track NDDC projects across the Niger Delta, we will today take a trip to Akwa Ibom State, where communities in Ibuno and Oron local government areas of Akwa Ibom State have drawn the attention of the Niger Delta Development Commission, NDDC, to the stalled state of some signature projects initiated to benefit them. Correspondent Nelson Aj reports that the non-completion of the projects is taking a huge toll on the development of the affected communities. When four years ago, a contract for the construction of Unwa Ayet Ikot Ita Idem Opa Ekposo Road and a bridge was awarded by the NDDC, it was no doubt a huge relief for the intended beneficiaries of the project in Akwaibom State. However, the people's hopes and aspirations have been dashed following a non-completion of the project. The project was meant to link over 20 riverine eastern communities in Ibno local government area. From the starting point is where we are now, you can see the job that has been done. Then the bridge here has been abandoned that the other area you cannot assess it. So we are now trying to let people know or ask entities or government why this road since we cannot get any information from the contractor what is really happening this road was commented by 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 NDC almost five years now but we don't know why this road i keep up to now they don't complete this road and now we can't look because this road is Tumbo. For me, I But we don't know why the contractor, they're giving this contract, are not doing this. We are lamenting. Also abandoned is a land reclamation and shoreline protection project. The contract was awarded to provide succor for some villages that were overtaken by seasonal coastal erosion. NDDC awarded a contract through uh, the plea from even of people to please come and do uh, whether resurfacing or construction of another shoreline to protect the area. And the contract was awarded to Smith Engineering Services, though I cannot precisely tell the year the contract was given to them. But as you can see now, the contract, this is their yard, which uh, the contract has been abandoned for some years now nothing has been done about it and you can even see the shoreline protection how it is now that if this project is not you know completed the people here will be exposed to more marine erosion problem meanwhile in our local government area there was a handful of uncompleted road projects by the NDDC, like the Marianne Road and the Oron Jetty Road. Lamenting on the hardship brought by the current state of the road, a resident of Oron, Esen F. Young, said the contractor had been operating in fix and start, leaving some stretch of the road uncompleted. The road starts from the Ebugu Road Junction to Marina at the Fort. So the Riani Road doesn't stop here at Tawanesen. So they did it. In fact, you can calculate from that junction to the to our, uh, Marina, Malvita, the status report. It's almost half of the road. So the Riani Road is not fully completed. Efforts to get details of the abandoned project awarded long before the appointment of the current interim management from the NDDC were unsuccessful, as most of the commission's top officials were invited to the National Assembly for an investigative hearing at the time of filing this report. Inside the Niger Delta, 